Howdy folks and welcome to another quick tutorial by Gamescape. Today we're going to fix some crashing for Fallout New Vegas and Fallout 3. If you're anything like me, after downloading the New Vegas stutter remover for your Fallout game on Windows 10, you might be experiencing a lot of crashing from your game. Every 10 to 15 minutes my game used to crash because of this. But don't worry, it's a really quick fix. First, you're going to want to navigate over to where your Fallout is installed. Now remember, this works for Fallout New Vegas and Fallout 3. So the file paths will be slightly different for those two games. Now, I've already made a shortcut here for my Fallout New Vegas folder. So my game is installed on drive D. It's in the Steam library, in the Steam apps folder, in the common folder. Then you get to the Fallout New Vegas folder. From there, we need to go into the data folder. From there, we need to get into this NVSE folder. If you are trying to fix your Fallout 3 game, it's gonna say FOSE, and you need to go in there. And that will bring you to the plugins folder. Now, open that, and you are looking for the new Vegas stutter remover.ini file. If you're working with Fallout 3, it should say Fallout 3 stutter remover .ini. now you're going to want to open that if it asks you what to use to open it choose the notepad and from here it's super easy basically all you need to do is change a couple of numbers after b hook critical sections equals yours is probably going to say one and it needs to be changed to a zero i have already done this on mine and you need to do the same on B-Hook Light Critical Sections right here, which I've already done. After that, click File, click Save, close that, and you should be good to go. Let me know if you need any further assistance with this down in the comments section. I try my best to help everybody who has any questions. If you have found that changing those two values did not help you, try changing some of the rest of these values to zeros and see if any of those help. So, you would change one, save it, go back to your game, see if it helps. If not, then come back, change another one to zero, save it, and, you know, rinse, repeat. But hopefully this helps anybody who's had issues with this. I know it took me a few hours to figure it out. Hopefully I've saved you those few hours. And please, if this helped, make sure to like it. It'll, it'll recommend the video to other people who are having the same issue, and it might help them. And of course, consider subscribing and take care of yourselves and each other. And we'll see you on the next one.